got another Christmas storybook for you today. It's called The Christmas Quest. And I'm going to give each of y'all one of these books so that you can read it later um, after I've read it to you. The Christmas Quest is by Janet Surratt and illustrated by Cesar Samiago. I think that's how you say it. This is about the wise men that came to see Jesus. Hello, what's this? A brand new star we've never seen before. We wonder what this star could mean. It's time that we explore. Unwrap the maps. Unroll the scrolls. Let's research the clues. Look, here are the stars announcing the King of the Jews. That's what the scrolls, the scriptures were telling them. So wake up everybody. There's a lot for us to pack. For many suns will rise and set before we make it back. They're going to go all the way to Bethlehem. Prepare our tents and fortunes for the greatest of all trips. Load up the camels, fetch the sheep, and don't forget the gifts. We're facing bandits, bugs, and beasts, so some might wonder why. We'd leave a palace for an invitation in the sky. We know why. We're going to go see Jesus. Why for the epic treasure hunt? For months we traveled west. No obstacles will keep us from the most important quest. But when we reach Jerusalem, this new king can't be found. And Herod's not too happy when we started to ask around. At least he called the priests and scribes to tell us where to go. And if we find the king, he hopes that we will let him know. So off to tiny Bethlehem, a mini journey more. And look above that house right there, the star we saw before. Look, it's pointing right to where baby Jesus was born. There's the Christmas star. We bow and gladly give our gifts. Our hearts could burst with cheer. Though we were very far away, Christ Jesus drew us near. Where he who has been born of King of the Jews, for we saw his star at its rising and have come to worship him. Matthew 2, 2. So that's the story of the three wise men who had studied so long about the coming of the baby Jesus who would be the new king of the Jews and God's son. So I hope you like that book. And this book um, is going to be in your home so you can look at it anytime you want to. Maybe next time you can read along with me. You'll have your book and you can read along. I love you. Bye.